Alright, today on the Happy Satellite Nerd, I'm going to review uh, the difference between this uh, DigiWave Power Signal Preamplifier and this RCA of course, sliding away there uh, Video Signal Amplifier for uh, amplifying your over-the-air TV your TV antenna signals to your other TVs throughout your house. Alright, I picked up this uh, DigiWave ANT 1005 amplifier. That's the French side. Yeah, so it's a power signal preamplifier for HDTV antenna. So it has a HDTV compatible. Uh, this is a, something about DVB. DVD T and etc. So maybe this can amplify a cable along a satellite dish. Anyway, I got rid of the Mission Thrift Store. So I'll do an unboxing of it. There's not much in here. It came in the box. The box is a little bang banged up, but it looks like it's never been used. Someone just got it and donated it to the thrift store. So here's the main part of it. The main part is actually there's not a whole lot to it. It's just the amplifier with a very feel like I'm going to lose a lot of, um, might possibly lose some uh, signal uh, through this little cable end here. And it has the little antenna, and to, this goes to your TV, and it has a little power supply jack there. It uses about uh, 12 volts. Okay, I'll get to show you the power supply. It's in here too. Here too. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a cable end thing. All right. And power supply. Okay. So I'm currently using an amplifier on my um, my TV. I just want to see if this thing will do better. This this device here will do better or worse. It's a mess of wires than the current one I have. Um, I find that in the winter months I lose a lot of the signal in the summertime I get a lot of the signal back but I'm debating whether or not maybe to get a fixed directional Yegi. Uh, Yegi is like uh, an antenna that would look like that. Um, and then aim it at one of the weak powered stations uh, nearby so I can pick that up. So here's this channel, channel 45.2 WNYC D2 out of Watertown, New York. The signal is coming in quite weak right now. This is the one I'm thinking I might want to get a um, a fixed directional Yagi just so I can get this one better because it has antenna TV, which is a good which is a channel of some shows I'd like to be able to get um, and just have it fixed on that. Uh, so this is a new one. It's NBC and um, and um, Antenna TV. So Antenna TV would be like the sub-channel. I'm going to go through some of my channels one. here. So I got channel 50.3, which is laugh. Some of the sub-channels uh, that I get. And it's coming in really good, like probably 100%. You know, it's, uh, it's not, not a problem for that one to come in. I can get snow and I can get PBS. PBS is coming in really good, 100%. All these, uh, all the sub channels for PBS. This channel comes in a little weaker, but actually, was, since I plugged my amplifier in, it's actually coming in much better. So this channel has MeTV. It actually, it's really annoying the way they broadcast this channel because it's a standard definition channel. They broadcast it at 480i, but yet you have this boxed bar around the image, so you have to kind of. If your TV has the option, you can zoom in and kind of use the theater mode on, on my TV. Gets rid of that the best. Gets so here are the, the two amplifiers way. side by side. Uh, this one, obviously, it's much bigger. I don't know if it's all power supply or whatever. 
I do like this one for that it um, it has not a wall wart like this one here it's a huge wall wart that's gonna like I need those that space to get it into the power bar here but um, yeah so I, I I'm just doing a test here to see which one works better so I got the the more gold colored one going in and the more silver colored one going out just for reference so it's going to plug into this end and go to here. I just put like a little, one of these little jacks, a female to female jack here so I can plug it into that when I plug it in. I think I'll make together. a note of is I'm still getting, I have it connected here with through the amplifier and I don't have it plugged in. So I'm getting about three bars uh, for uh, BTV. All right, so here it is plugged in and we're going to plug it in to this thing here. I hate wall warts, like, you know, this is probably the best invention, in my opinion. Anyway, just my little pet peeve on that. Alright, so I got the amplifier going. I'm still getting three bars, as if it were not plugged in at all. So I'll go through some channels so I put it over on laugh, and I'm getting about the same, uh, the same amount of quality over on laugh. 7.1, I'm getting good quality same as what I had before. I do have my little antenna mover thingy here for my, can you see it there, the, the low light. Um, it has an amplifier in it as well, but I just use the extra amplifier so that I can amplify it to the other TVs throughout the house. And my final verdict would be this channel 45 WN, w, uh, WVNC out of uh, Watertown, New York, which was coming in with the uh, amplifier I was using in the beginning. It's not coming in at all with the uh, the little tiny pl uh, plug amplifier. All right, my final verdict. Uh, this one here, I don't think it's as good, like this little piece here, I don't think it's doing as good of a job as this thing here. This amplifier that I've had, it's a 10, D, it's a 10 dB amplifier. 50 to 900 megahertz. Um, I'm finding this one's performing a lot better than this one. Another thing is I don't like that wire there, that wire, that cheap little wire coming out of it. Where this one, it, it's a, it's a metal case with uh, like I find these things. I probably picked it up at a thrift store or something. Like it was made. This is 20, over 20 years old. This device, but it seems like it's built well and it's still holding up. It's still. Like this is what I've been using, <laughs> and I was wondering, oh, my this amplifier is not working, but also you gotta make sure that they're plugged in. <laughs> but even still, the, these both these devices were work were having pass through, so you, I was still getting signal even when they were not plugged in. Uh, but this DigiWave uh, amplifier, uh, I think I'd have to say this one here, this RCA metal one is working works a lot better than uh, the DigiWave. So as you see in here, that's my opinion. Please like, share, and subscribe. Um, and yeah, if you're looking to get an outdoor antenna, uh, I highly recommend having an amplifier, especially if you're using a master antenna system like what I use at my house where I distribute the signal to more than one TV. I got the killer balloon! I'll shoot I it. I got the killer balloon! Ah! 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 Ah!